Hello everyone, this is going to be an in-game look and preview and review of the new Star Wars The Old Republic item, the Fallen Revan's Lightsaber. And this item was added along with two other Revan-related items in the cartel market. So I'm going to be showing off this lightsaber and talking a little bit about its history. So first off... It has a really simple plain ignition sound as well as background hum sound. You don't have to worry about any crazy, crazy lightsaber sounds with this one or any effects actually. It's a very, very simple lightsaber and it also is a very, very plain hilt. So the players who are gonna be most interested in this simplistic hilt are going to be those who enjoy the lore of the Old Republic, Knights of the Old Republic, and in general, the character Revan. Something very interesting about this lightsaber is that it's not exactly uh, Revan's most well-known lightsaber. Um, when you think of Revan, most players think of a purple lightsaber that he has that has some very uh, kind of three prongs on it. They're kind of like a protective sheath around uh, the point where the hilt meets the blade. And that is a very distinctive purple lightsaber, which isn't used quite as much as red in the Old Republic era. However, this is his red lightsaber, and uh, Revan has actually been through many, many iterations of his lightsabers over the years. There is his lightsaber in the Knights of the Old Republic comics, the Knights of the Old Republic game, games, multiple, plural. Um, there's the Knights of the Old Republic book, as well as the book cover. Um, and there's also been Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes, both Darth Revan and Light Side Revan. And each of those are all slightly different. This version is most similar, I would believe, to the one that we see in the Knights of the Old Republic game. Um, especially at the very beginning, you see Bastila Shan finding Darth Revan on a ship and she takes him down and has a special choice she has to make. And during that scene, we see Darth Revan fighting with a single red lightsaber. And that, I believe, is the one that's trying to be depicted here. However, those old cutscenes are so low quality in that game, the movie-like cinematics, that you can't even really get a non-pixelated version screenshot of that lightsaber. So I believe that's the one that this is trying to emulate. And if you search for the words Revan Sith lightsaber. This is usually the one that comes up and many cosplayers and lightsaber builders have actually kind of picked this one out as the secondary lightsaber for Revan. So I don't have a lot to say about the actual model of this lightsaber other than it seems pretty high definition for a low, uh, low detail lightsaber. It looks nice, very simple, probably be good for both a Jedi or for a Sith because it's got silver with a bit of gold on it and a bit of black. So now I'm going to pop some other color crystals in there so you can see what that looks like. Let's throw a blue one in here, or a teal one rather. And we've got a derelict purple one in the other one. So it looks pretty just fine with the crystals, nothing crazy. And I'm also going to put a weapon tuning in each one so you can see what that looks like too. So we'll put the dark side channeling into the... <laughs> we got some friends in the background apparently. And a dark attuned weapon tuning in the other one. So that's what it'll look like with a weapon tuning if you decide to put one in there. Um, as a heads up, this lightsaber is probably going to be pretty dang expensive. Don't expect it to be cheap on the GTN. And on the cartel market, it is not part of the bundle. You'll search for Fallen, and you'll have Fallen Revan's lightsaber. And at the moment, uh, normal price, it's 1300 cartel coins. So when you're looking to purchase this, make sure to compare your cartel coins to dollars if you're buying cartel coins. Or if you're spending free cartel coins or you're buying it from the GTN, make sure to compare the price of cartel coins versus the cost of credits and decide if it's still something you want to get. So enjoy, and I'm very excited to have these three different Revan items added to the game. See you later.